Hey there everyone, welcome back in React.js Instagram clone app video tutorial series. I'm Azhar Slim. In this video tutorial, we are going to design our comment section. So let's see in the demo. Let's look like I'm going to in our demo application. So actually, uh, we have to sign in because he is still our input field is not coming. okay so we have to design something like that uh, we have here comments username comment and here we have a text input field if I type something here we can send or post actually this comment so let's first design this uh, comments for that I'm going to create a new component inside our component new file the name is uh, comments dot js right here uh, functional component and uh, I'm going to open material UI go to material UI and uh, list such here the list uh, show you just go here um, material UI and you can find from here <coughs> list from here okay so I'm going back here in list and uh, we will use uh, this list so extract it and uh, I'm going to copy from here list all the code copy remove div tag and uh, we have to import as well react uh, styles and uh, divider all these things just copy paste here that's it now let's import in our post.js and uh, I'm going to import from current directory we have a comments and uh, import then below this caption and username let's copy it here do tag and uh, pass here class comments mm. okay only comments but pass here post underscore underscore it's a BAM function and uh, here just import comments that's it perfect now we have here comments next thing uh, let's see here actually here we have a picture uh, image uh, that I take a URL and put let's copy this URL go to comments in our avatar if I place this comment here sorry this uh, URL now image will appear here. here you can see I'm going to also replace here and as well here 
with our first avatar save now here we are the images now it's look like uh, near to our comment section here we have a comment and the username I'm going to remove uh, the two it's a total three uh, we'll keep here only one and uh, I'm going to delete our last one and as well second last so delete this last divider save it oh, perfect we have one comment and here put something this is comment and here username Perfect. We have a username and the comments. Okay, it's a, actually only a design or a static code. We'll make here. In the we will uh, create comment and fetch from our Firebase. Okay, next step we need here a text field and a button. So let's go back to post.js. And after this comment section, form inside that form, we need a text field. And actually, I import uh, already here. Otherwise, just go to Material UI and uh, search here text field, and you will find from here. Let's go for demo. It is all text field are available. Whatever you like, just copy and use in your project. Okay, variant. Uh, it's better if I copy from there to save uh, with time. Okay, I'm going to. The size is small here. I'll take this second last or it's more better if I copy from my uh, demo project okay I'm going to copy all just remove one click and value save and uh, next sub button send and also we have to pass here radiant and uh, size again copy from here it's better to save over time I will explain you what's happening here. Send icon we have to import. I'll show you how to import icon. Just go to display data and uh, under display uh, data display we have here material icons otherwise you have to search. Send and uh, copy just go here and place it now we successfully import so it's already available here my bad it's my uh, demo project sorry let's go to our react project here we have to import
and uh, remove this cable and on click just save it and uh, here we have a text field and a button okay perfect next step <coughs> we have to make it something look like that so this is not small I think it's medium uh, small or medium let's check from our demo project so small okay and you'll just make a design for it so you no need for type submit and uh, let's go to post.css yeah first of all we have here form and uh, let's pass a class post scroll form and uh, scroll to post.css display flex ok then margin top 20 pixels save it ok we have margin from top 20 pixels and uh, in next step we have here post input class uh, name inside our text field flex one now perfect okay it's uh, near to our demo project okay just little bit more things like it's not a disable and uh, functionality we have to attach uh, add here this uh, react.js so comment section is done if I repeat it now perfect we have our comments and the username here yeah. in this video tutorial we discuss how to add a list and uh, a text feed and a button for our comment so in last let me show you what's happening here first of all in our comments all this uh, code we took from material UI and we import list mix style divider uh, list item text and avatar so on after that here is a use styles you can make your own styles here like your for your for example ul or paper styling or any uh, what you want to add here css classes and uh, here functional component which we generate after create this uh, comment.js and uh, here we return the list which we copy from material ui his class name classes root which is defined here but with 100 percent and max width and the background color after that we have a list item and list avatar inside list avatar we have this avatar this one in list avatar we pass alt and source image which i copy the same image url and uh, that's it after that we have a list item text which is this username and uh, comment so here we have a username and in secondary we pass here the react fragment inside there we have the uh, this uh, bunch of code like uh, the color class name variant component and uh, here we have this is a comment so that's it and at the last we have a divider this will generate a loop using uh, 
ESX function uh, map. So this comment when we will fetch from uh, Firebase, it will repeat here. And uh, at the last, we did here. We create a form and pass a form uh, this uh, post form class. And first, we have here text input field and a button. In text input field, we have take a uh, label add comment and the size is small the variant outline if i remove this variant it will be normal uh, text field without any border you can set like that <coughs> after that we have a class name placeholder inside a button we have a variant it's a uh, contained and uh, size small and end icon this icon which we pass uh, import send icon and pass here so that's for this uh, video tutorial see you next one